YouTube, how you doing today? Dolph Real here again, bringing you a Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplay. Today, what we're going to talk about is how Treyarch have answered our prayers. Yes, that is right, guys. Treyarch have answered our prayers. How often have you guys gone into a fucking game, you're getting absolutely fucking dominated, or you go into a game and the team that you join is getting beaten in domination, fucking 150 to 10, and there's kill streaks everywhere, there's fucking helicopters in the sky, there's just, your team's getting fucking murdered, so you leave, try to join another game, but get put back in the same fucking game. Honestly, this happens to me all the fucking time. You got, because I play a lot of free for all, I go into a game, I'll get, someone will get the final kill cam, or, Someone will start dominating, someone will be running around with fucking C4 noob tubes. I'll just be like, fuck it, I'll just leave, I'll join another game. Leave, click free for all, and it puts me in the same lobby. Why have Call of Duty never fixed this problem up until now? Honestly, what the fuck is the point of leaving a game, joining a game, and getting put back in the same fucking lobby you just left? You obviously left for a reason. So why would they put you back in the same lobby? It honestly, it makes no fucking sense. No sense at all. But for some reason, for the last 10 years, Call of Duty have never fixed it. But Black Ops 3, they have said right now that rage quitting, it's not such a bad thing. Because sometimes, you do it for a reason. Like, I know a lot of people will rage quit because they're fucking shit at the game. And yes, that will always be the case. But, there is those sometimes where the matchmaking will put you in, honestly, a fucking shit lobby. It might... I have unfair teams. How many times do you go into a game and you get put with a bunch of retards and you're playing against a six-man party? Honestly, it happens all the time and no one wants to do that. You don't want to have to cop a fucking beating every single game because of the matchmaking. You don't want to go into a lobby and not be able to leave, try and find another game, but then, like, you don't want to just continuously get put in the same game and get your ass fucking raped every single game. It just takes the fun out of it. So, thank fuck... Black Ops 3 is going to have this whatever the fuck they do so that you don't go into another lobby and join the same one you just left. It's honestly, it's a very small thing guys and I know a lot of you probably think that no one else has ever really noticed it but I know that all of you right now will be watching this and thinking oh my fucking god, I, that happens to me all the time. I'll be playing a game of domination, free for all, team deathmatch, whatever. My team is fucking shit, they're getting fucked up. The, Three people down the bottom are going 2 and 20, 3 and 20, 4 and fucking 453, whatever. Your team's doing fucking shit. The other team's just got helicopter after helicopter after helicopter. And you don't want to sit there and cop that dick up the ass any longer. So you leave. You go back into it. You click on domination again. It's like searching for good game. 3 of 26. It's like, well, why can't it put me in a different fucking lobby rather than the one it just... But I just rage quit from. Why can't it put me in one of those other 26 good games? Why the fuck does it always have to put me into the one that I just got fucking out? I just got out of. It's just fucking stupid. Thank fuck, Black Ops 3 is going to be different. Thank God they've decided to fucking use their brains and decide. Okay, if someone leaves the lobby, let's only put them back in that lobby as a really last resort. So thank fuck, guys. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you think that is a fucking great news. I think it's great news. I'll give this video a thumbs up myself because I honestly, that when I heard that was going to happen, I was absolutely stoked. I, there's no more for me going into a game, getting fucked up the ass, leaving, getting put back in the game, and then fucking snapping my fucking disc because I can't get into a lobby that has normal people in it. It's stupid. Thank fuck for Black Ops 3. Thank fuck for them using their fucking brains. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Until next time, this was Dolph Riddle. I'll see you in the next video.